today's video is all about Switzerland's shopping paradise towns Kastad and Sanen. And also in this video, we will be showing you some of the shooting locations of the famous DDLJ movie. Hello guys, this is your host Arpita. Welcome back to Travel Opus. Gashtad is a friendly car-free village, a rather charming, attractively located place full of restored weatherwood chalets between four gentle sloping valleys. This is one of the few towns in the Alps that offer the absolute best combination of alpine scenery, luxurious hotels, exclusive shopping, and very fine restaurants. This Kastad Palace you can see is a luxurious hotel which is widely known as the notable destination for various celebrities and politicians. This town is full of luxuries and that is why famous royal guests and visitors from the worlds of film, art, sports and science come here to appreciate its charms. Despite its prestige, Gashtad has remained genuinely alpine and down to earth. You get tempted by a lot of shops displaying both Swiss and international renowned brands of clothes, shoes, watches and so on. Of course, there are several places offering food, ice creams and coffee. But if you are travelling with a controlled budget, then you have to lock your pocket. Here, you will going to see major famous brands like Louis Vuitton, Hermes, Chopin, Prada, Dobry, Perfumery, Ralph Lauren and of course the Swiss famous Rolex. In general, when we heard the name of such huge brands, we imagine some kind of fancy buildings. But looking at these historical buildings, trust me, gives you a total different impact. we talk about Switzerland, the first thing that comes to our mind is of course the iconic movie DDLJ. We will going to start further by visiting Sanin. Located on the hillside, this town has its own magical beauty and an incredible landscape, of course accompanied by beautiful DDLJ locations. The train journey time between Gestad and Sanin is around 4 minutes and covers a distance of around 2 kilometers. And like every Indian, I was also very excited to see all the places where the scenes of this iconic movie has been shot. And I was amazed when I visited Information Center, I got the list of all the locations. I must say, this movie has played a vital role in promoting Switzerland tourism. And now it's time to check out some of the most prominent filming destinations from the film. This film has been majorly shot in parts of Switzerland, India and London. Those who don't know, DDLJ as in Dilwale Dulaniya Le Jayenge 
is the story of two Indians, Raj and Simran, living in London with their families. After completing their education, they take off with their friends for a month long you rail trip with their friends. So first, we have come to Sanan railway station and the scene which you can clearly see on the screen was shot right over here. Now we are at famous Sanan Bridge where Simran tells Raj that her marriage was already fixed with her dad's friend's son who she has never met or seen. When Simran is walking away, Raj tells himself that she will definitely look back if she loves him. There goes Palat, Palat, Palat. And of course, how can we forget this romantic scene from the song? And there you can clearly see the runway where Shah Rukh Khan run against a plane which is exactly behind the Sanan Bridge. Now let me take you to explore the St. Mauritius Church in Sanan. This is the same famous church from the movie where Simran takes Raj to church and starts praying where Raj who is an atheist makes fun of her and yet stays back only to ask for Simran's wishes to come true. How romantic! <laughs> Here, you all must be wondering why the interior of the church is different from the film. So let me tell you because the interior of the church has been shot at another church in Interlaken. So now, back in Gashtad, hey, do you remember this famous scene from the song where drunk Simran enters the chocolate shop early back situated on the promenade and runs outside leaving Raj to pay the bill? And you must have seen this horse cart in the song Zara Sa Jhumlu Mein. This was shot right over here. But you can see now one cute dog is enjoying his moment. So let's not disturb him and let me take you further. Now we are going to Swaziman for next movie location. The next turning point in this epic romance is when Raj and Simran miss their train to Zurich without their luggage and friends who manage to board the train. Simran is shown buying a cowbell at a kiosk at the railway station which you can clearly see from here which is originally in Zweizemann. It is here that she and Raj lose track of time and miss the train. So after accomplishing my childhood dream, 
it's time for me to end this video here see you until next time ciao